Hello friends, today we will learn about uterus. Uterus is a childbearing organ present in female reproductive system. Its location is in the lesser pelvis, also called as true pelvis, located in between urinary bladder and rectum. It is pyriform in shape. The measurements of uterus are 7.5 into 5 into 2.5 centimeter. Weight is around 40 grams. The parts are upper expanded part known as body, which is around 5 centimeter, and lower cylindrical part, which is known as cervix, which is around 2.5 centimeter. Let's learn how to draw different diagrams of this topic. We will begin with position and relations of uterus. Start with pubic symphysis. Behind the pubic symphysis show urinary bladder. In relation to the superior surface and base of the urinary bladder show uterus and vagina. Now show rectum and anal canal in the posterior relation of uterus and vagina respectively. Next draw perineal membrane which is pierced by urethra and vagina. Now we will draw anterior abdominal wall. Then we will start drawing peritoneum. In between uterus and urinary bladder there is peritoneal fold called uterovesical pouch. It is also a false support of uterus. Next we will continue behind in between uterus and rectum there is recto uterine pouch of Douglas. In between vagina and anal canal show the fibromuscular node perineal body. Let's draw a diagram to show external and internal features of uterus. Begin with fundus, lateral walls of the body and cervix. Show the cervical canal. Draw vagina. Show lateral fornix of the vagina around the vaginal part of the cervix. Draw cavity of body of uterus. Also draw fallopian tube. Draw round ligament of uterus anterior to the fallopian tube. Draw ovary and ligament of ovary in posterior relation to uterine tube. Draw lateral pelvic wall to show lateral relations of the uterus. In between lateral border of the uterus and lateral pelvic wall show the broad ligament and suspensory ligament of ovary show important contents of the broad ligament like ureter tortuous uterine artery and ovarian artery running within the infundibulo pelvic ligament and anastomosing with uterine artery draw levator ani muscle which is the main muscular support of the uterus Let's understand angulations of the uterus with the help of diagrams. Normally uterus is antiverted and antiflexed. Angle of antiflexion is the angle between long axis of body of the uterus and long axis of cervix. Whereas angle of antiversion is in between long axis of cervix and long axis of vagina. Angle of antiflexion is around 170 degree. Whereas antiversion is around 90 degree. We can remember V for vagina and V for version. So angle between cervix and vagina is antiversion. These angles are maintained by pull off round ligament of uterus anteriorly. Whereas pull off uterosacral ligament posteriorly. Let's draw supports of the uterus. These are described as secondary supports primary fibromuscular and primary muscular supports broad ligament is secondary support lateral or 
ट्रांसफर सर्वाइकल लिगामेंट इज प्राइमरी फाइब्रोमस्क्युलर सपोर्ट लिवेटर एन आई एंड यूरोजेनाइटल डायफ्राम आर प्राइमरी मस्क्युलर सपोर्ट्स पेरिनियल बॉडी इज वन ऑफ द इम्पॉर्टेंट मस्क्युलर सपोर्ट ऑफ यूटरस इट इज मेड अप ऑफ टेन पेरिनियल मसल्स लेटस ड्रॉ द पेरिनियल बॉडी ड्रॉ टू बल्बोस्पॉन्जियोज मसल देन ड्रॉ टू सुपरफिशियल ट्रांसफर्स पेरिनाय टू डीप ट्रांसफर्स पेरिनाय एक्सटर्नल एनल स्पिंटर एंड सराउंडिंग इट लिवेटर एन आई मसल द लॉन्जिट्यूडनल मसल कोट इज नॉट शोन इन द डायग्राम लेट्स ड्रॉ फाइब्रस सपोर्ट ऑफ द यूटरस स्टार्ट विथ क्यूबिक सिम्फाइसिस एंटेरियरली सैक्रम पोस्टेरियरली एंड लैटरल पेलविक वॉल ऑन इच साइड शो थ्री ओपनिंग्स इन द मिड लाइन फ्रॉम एंटेरियर टू पोस्टेरियर यूरिथ्रल ओपनिंग सर्वाइकल ओपनिंग एंड ओपनिंग ऑफ द रेक्टम ड्रॉ प्यूबो सर्वाइकल लिगामेंट्स फ्रॉम प्यूबिस टू द सर्वाइकल ओपनिंग ड्रॉ ट्रांसफर्स सर्वाइकल और द लैटरल सर्वाइकल लिगामेंट्स फ्रॉम द लैटरल वॉल ऑफ द पेलविस टू द सर्विक्स Draw uterosacral ligament posteriorly from the sacrum to the cervix. To show lymphatic drainage, draw abdominal aorta, bifurcation into common iliac and external and internal iliac vessels. Fundic region it will be draining towards the paraaortic lymph nodes. Body and the cervix they will be draining mainly towards external. internal iliac and obturator nodes posterior wall of the cervix will be draining towards sacral nodes small part of the corner of the uterus at the opening of the uterine tube it drain towards the superficial group of inguinal lymph nodes along a round ligament of uterus thank you all for watching this video please like share and subscribe easy anatomy for ug on instagram and youtube